If you purchase a product key for your Windows Server 2022 Evaluation Edition, and if you go to the Settings section under Activation tab, when you enter the product key, you might get an error message like this one. It'll tell you the product key you enter didn't work, check the product key and try again or enter a different one and it'll have the error code. Let's look at how you can activate the Windows Server 2022 Evaluation Edition when you have a valid purchase Windows key. To bypass this particular error, open Windows PowerShell in administrative mode in your server. Then you need to enter this particular code DISM online slash get current edition and that will give you the edition available to you. So this is Windows Center Data Center Evaluation Edition right now. Then we can do DISM online slash get target edition and it tells that we can do the target upgrade to Windows Server Data Center. Then we enter this particular code which is the DISM slash online slash set edition data center server and then you enter your product key slash accept EULA and when you press enter it will go through the process of evaluating your key connecting to the Windows servers and installing the required packages and the key for uh, your system. This might take a little time depending on your internet speed, but however, if you get stuck, for example, if it is stuck at 88.3% or something like that, uh, you may want to press enter on your Windows PowerShell. So just click on the uh, screen and then press enter because sometimes it is already done. So once you are done that, it'll ask you, do you want to restart your computer? And we're going to say why for yes, because that's when it will get uh, completed, the process. So it will go ahead and complete the installation process now. So basically, we have installed the purchase key and bypassed that error message. Once the server has been rebooted and you end up on the logging screen, just simply log in, just like any other time. I'm simply going to change the, um, the scaling so it's easy for you guys to see. Then go into your Windows PowerShell uh, and administrative uh, mode. Unfortunately, the scaling didn't work, but that, let's try this. Uh, basically, we're going to run the same command. You can use the arrow up key to get current edition. And we see that the server data center full edition has been installed. Now it is activated and we have bypassed that error message that we saw before. You can also verify this information from the settings section of your uh, server. Again, I'm going to change the scaling so it's easy for you guys to see. It's keep changing because this is a virtual machine. Um, I could have, oh, uh, yeah, I could have go back um, to the settings section from display. Let's go to the settings from here. Go to the settings section, about section, and we see that the Windows Server 2022 data center a full edition has been activated. That's how you can activate your Windows Server 2022 Evaluation Edition and roll it over to a full edition using a purchase key. If you have any questions or concerns regarding any of the items that we covered today, you are feel free to reach out to me. I will leave all the commands that are used in the Windows PowerShell in the description of this video. If you like these type of instructional videos, please make sure to thumbs up this video and subscribe to my channel. And until next time, have a nice day.